Lucas Media. So I'm on X, I guess that's what they're calling it now, right? And <clears throat> I see that Black America is uh, trending. Now, you know, me pushing uh, midlife as a as a brother in, in America, started going through the timeline, and I started seeing some of these photos, right, as you can see in the slide. Of course, I had to do my own research and uh, started pulling out pictures, and all of these are from during the days of uh, segregation. Now, we'll see what YouTube does with this video. Who knows? They'll take it down. But... You know, what do you see different in these in these pictures that you don't see now? Hmm. I'll wait. And there's many of them, too. There's many of them, you know, and this is for multiple entities. So, you know, don't come on here saying that I'm just going one way. What do you see? You know, you know how they said pictures worth a thousand words. Look at it. What has changed between the height of Jim Crow and segregation and now? You see people smiling. You know, you don't see. Whoop, see, I'm gonna go too far. I'm gonna have to. I'm. I'm gonna have to go and rumble for this for the more deeper, the more deeper video. But just look at these pictures. I mean, my God. How far have we fallen? <laughs> you know, some of y'all, um, I know y'all had grandmothers and, and uh, that was probably born in at least the 1950s back. You know, for your people who's fortunate enough to have uh, eldermen, elder states people, statesmen and women that old. You know, that's fortunate to still be alive. Go back and ask them how was time different versus now. I remember I asked my grandmother who was born 1920, June of 1920. This is my grandmother. We ain't talking about great greats or anything like grandmother. I asked her, would you want to live in our air? And she said, absolutely not. And I used to be like, why, grandma? You know, it ain't like how it was. And, you know, like I said, Jim Crow and all of that and. You know, she explained it to me, and I wish I could say it on YouTube, but since it's become very sensitive, can't get too deep, but I see why she said that. Look at these pictures. We don't have to go, no, we don't have to go back a hundred years. You know how y'all, how y'all try to start history at 1865 or a little bit prior? No, no, no. Look at your history. Look at how we were after 1865 as a family. This is all documented evidence. You don't have to believe nothing that I'm saying. You know? What if Jet Magazine, Ebony Magazine uh, came today? How do you think these people look on the cover? Oops. See? Hold on. Let me take a break. I'm getting too carried away. So, I just, I just want y'all to, you know, I want y'all to put in the comment section, but... I'm sorry. I mean, <laughs> pictures are worth a thousand words, right? <laughs>